Hi there, Libra, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for the week of June the 1st through to the 7th. I went ahead, shuffled the cards, laid them all out. Let's see what's going on for Libra. First up, we have the Page of Cups in the upright, followed then by the Eight of Pentacles upright. Next, we have Major Arcana, the Magician upright. Next, we have the uh, Knight of Cups in the upright. And lastly, the Seven of Wands reversed. So your overall energy is that of the sweet page of cups in the upright position. Does someone have a crush on you, Libra? Is someone sending you cute little love notes? <laughs> this is the page of cups energy. It could be connected to a Leo. Leo also got this card too. Maybe you're sending um, uh, cute little love notes to each other. <laughs> This uh, is water energy, that of Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, male or female. Uh, the Page of Cups can sometimes uh, represent an apology. Maybe somebody is, you know, may, um, trying to make up with you, trying to make nice for others of you. Somebody could just be sending you sweet little cute messages. For some of you, this could be representative of a child, a grandchild, or someone that you are just watching. Could be someone you babysit, uh, niece, nephew, that kind of thing. The child is just being very adorable. The Page of Cups loves like they've never been hurt. Very sweet energy can be extremely uh, romantic too. So if it's a romantic partner, um, this person could be incredibly uh, cutesy this week for you. <laughs> now, coming right off the hump, we have the Eight of Pentacles here in the upright position. The Eight of Pentacles can be representative of it's the worker bee card. This is where we're working very hard towards accomplishing something. Now, for some of you, this could be uh, maybe you're renovating your home and you're, you know, putting the finishing touches on it. For others of you, this could be you're building your um, financial portfolio. Perhaps you're, you know, working towards that because you have a goal to get to the nine of pentacles. Uh, some of you could just be working very hard on a project or working really, really hard at work. Maybe you're just keeping your nose to the grindstone, just trying to bring in that cash because you're, you have a goal in mind. And it's followed up by the beautiful energies of the magician in the upright position. You are the alchemist in the early part of this week. You are busy. It looks like you're working towards something. You're very focused. I've been seeing that lately for the um, Libra energy. Very, very focused, trying to get things accomplished. I think a lot of you have a specific goal in mind, whether it be romantic or whether it be creative or whether it be financial whatever the situation is, you are very focused and you're trying to be the alchemist this week. And I think you're pulling it off. <laughs> and the next card we have up is more water energy. This is Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Arising, Male or Female. Now we have the knight in shining armor showing up here. Talk about the romantic dreamer. And this is an actual offer coming towards you, Libra. This could be definitely from the same person. Now, just because it's water energy doesn't necessarily mean it's a water sign. Could be any sign. First, somebody could just start messaging you. Maybe they've um, seen your picture online or something like that. And they just have a crush on you and they started messaging you. Now the full-on offer comes towards you. So for some of you, yes, this could be new love. For others of you, this could be representative of an offer on the creative front. Maybe if you are a magician, a magician, a musician, an actor, a painter, or a, a writer, someone who's in the creative field, it could be that there is an offer coming towards you in terms of that. Others of you, this could be... <clears throat> about somebody who's just really, really romantic and they, they're coming in and they just want to offer you some romance. It could be a weekend of romance. It could be a month of romance, a summer romance. Uh, for others of you, it's just an offer coming towards you that's dear to your heart. And the last card you have up is the Seven of Wands in the reverse position. This is good news, especially following these cards because of the fact that this is where we're letting down our defenses for some the seven of wands in the upright position this can be when someone's guarding their heart right he has the staff in front of his heart so this is like nobody's going to be able to penetrate that when it's inverted like this this could be dropping our defenses and not being so uh guarded of the heart 
for others of you. This could be if you were, say, in a situation where you, where you were protecting yourself, protecting your privacy, protecting someone else. It could be now you've dropped it. You, you don't feel the need to protect yourself, your privacy, or even someone else. Perhaps something else has come to light and you no longer feel that you should be protecting this person. Remember, only takes take what resonates for you. If it doesn't resonate, then the reading is not meant for you. So that is your reading, Libra. Um, I hope it helped you. If it did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. Otherwise, I will see you next week. Have a great week. Bye-bye.